Welcome back. This is day two of our week-long custom build-off. It's only Tuesday, so we're going to be bringing you our second build. Three more builders still to come, so stay tuned. If you didn't watch the first builder and you're coming like, what is this going on? You need to watch Ruben Rodriguez build the Death Slayer machine out in here. Super sweet. So I don't know what our other builders are going to do. Uh, speaking of other builders, let's introduce today's challenger. We got new employee James Webb in the house. What's up, guys? Boom. So, you ready to get building? Yeah, let's do it. All right, he's got free reign of the whole place, no time limit, uh, nothing like that. So, good to get going. All right, guys, follow me. I'm um, walking by this. I'm gonna go ahead and grab my headset while I'm here. It's a Tilt integrated headset in gold. And I'm going with the Raptor Corey Van Lu grips, black. Getting some raw affinity T-bars that were actually improperly cut by one of our employees. They got a slit and didn't need it, so I'm gonna go ahead and take advantage of them. So with that, I'm gonna go with a gold tilt double clamp and a lucky HIC kit. 21 inch TSI Paramount deck right here. So if you know me, you probably don't, but most people know I ride TSI decks. I'm gonna go with some Hep Greg Signature River Rapid Wheels. Right over here, I'm going with the Tilt Quick Script Grip. And it's just going to take all of it. I don't got time for that right now. Oh, I forgot my fork. So my fork's right over here. I knew I was missing something. So going with the TSI Vendel fork. You don't see these very often, so got to give TSI some support on their fork. And there's my buddy Ruben with his little devil scooter. No one wants that. <clears throat> Not that strong. All right, so we're gonna start off by gripping the scooter and my coworker Ruben would go ahead and take the rest of this grip tape back to the back of the shop for me. I'd really appreciate that. Thank you, sir. And we're gonna get to gripping this thing. No, I am not the James that edits all the YouTube videos. James Hole, our actual video photographer guy, is not me. Um, but I am gonna start helping him editing YouTube videos and stuff like that. You'll see some of my videos coming out pretty soon. He was the inspiration behind the pizza build. As most people know, that was not me. James thinks that if he was in the contest, he would win, but I disagree. The deck perfectly fits the nut, so you, have, you don't need any tool for it. So as you can see, it's really hard to get it on the axle, but once it's on the axle, everything goes very smooth, no tool. All I gotta do is just twist it tight, and it just tightens perfectly. Perfect. There's that, it's back end of the deck done. We'll start putting together the front end. All right, so I'm gonna grease the headset cups in here just so that headset never creaks and it just runs perfectly smooth. So you just put a bunch of grease in there on both sides. Just like that. So I'm gonna hit him with a rubber mallet. Just so. Uh, oh, thank you. We're just gonna give it a little taps. Cut. All right, that went in with my fingers that time. Oh, and it went away. And then for this build, we're using HIC. So I have a lucky HIC kit here. Cut. All right, so I'm gonna go grab a Phoenix HIC kit because the shim is shorter. So I put that there and then grab this. So as you guys see, the fork sticks out pretty minuscule, so we got a smaller HIC shim, so it'll just slide right on like that. And you put your compression bolt in, and still not long enough. So we gotta find a little bit longer bolt. There we go, this one's a little longer. We're gonna grease it up, so actually let's check, see if it reaches first, it does. We're gonna grease it up a little bit. We're gonna go ahead and bolt it in. Nope, still doesn't want to. Bearing spacers being a little bit not my friend today. Looks like it wants to go, and there we go. So here's what it's looking like so far. Looks really sweet. 
Uh, now I'm just gonna go ahead and put the clamp on the bars. Six mil bolts on this clamp, tilt double. Actually, we're gonna bring it down just a little bit. So it covers the HIC shim. There we go. Looks beautiful now. Raptor Corey Van Loo signature grips. These guys are real long, big and soft. Very, very nice grips. Especially when you drop them. There you go. Looks sweet. Now last thing, put in the bar ends. These wanna go in. These should go right in, so. Okay, so I'm gonna file down the first little rib. So we're gonna use this little table grinder, bench grinder, whatever you wanna call it. So I rounded out the first little rib. That way it'll just slide right in for me. And there you go. I'm gonna use this little mallet. Hit it in real nice. I'm gonna do one little personal touch. I've been saving the sticker for this. It is a TSI scumbag sticker. And I'm gonna go ahead and put it on the head tube, just like I do my personal scooters. All right, guys, James just finished building his custom scooter, so let's check that thing out. Whoo, I mean, first of all, it just flies in there like that. Um, yeah, man, I'm really impressed so far with the two custom builds we have. I mean, if they were both sitting on a shelf and I had to choose one, I wouldn't know what to do. And we have three more builders coming up. So we got the HIC kit on this, definitely something kind of rare from the vault. We tend, to, we tend to do a lot of SES, so this is really cool. Affinity getting more love, two days in a row of Affinity bars. Uh, we got the Raptor Cory Van Loo grips, looking so good. And who doesn't love this color of blue right there? The seafoam blue, all the gold, lots of TSI, bonus points for throwing in the scumbag sticker. Super clean build from James, so anything you wanna say about it? I love it, everything came out nice. Uh, it's an exact replica of a scooter I used to ride, minus I used to ride uh, white on gold wheels rather than the Hep Gregs, but the Hep Gregs are a thousand times better, so I'm super stoked on it. If you didn't see our last video with Ruben, make sure to check that out. Stay tuned for tomorrow to see who our next custom builder is gonna be. I know you're gonna like it. Make sure to subscribe, share this video. Comment below who's better at building, Ruben or James. <laughs>